What is going on everybody? I am back today with another card video. We got 2019 Topps WWE NXT, two autographs per box in this hobby box. This is honestly my favorite thing about this box is the fact that there's two guaranteed autographs. You don't have to worry about patches or commemorative whatevers. You don't have to worry about matte relics or shirt relics. You got two autographs guaranteed. The only relics in here obviously are the auto relics, which is awesome. Uh, I got one of these boxes when they first came out. Uh, here's kind of the the heads that I got from that. Uh, we got the NXT Chicago, not the one that I was at, but it's number to 50, blue. Tommaso Ciampa defeats Johnny Gargano in a Chicago street fight. And then my autos, we got Punishment Martinez, AKA Damian Priest. And then honestly, like one of the best hits I've ever pulled uh, in wrestling, a gold three of 10 Lacey Evans autographed NXT called up. So uh, that is awesome. Uh, and so we'll have to see what this box brings us because not too sure what to expect from this, but hey, it is what it is. We get two autographs, you can't go wrong. Let's unbox a uh, Topps product with a panini knife. You can't, can't go too crazy with that, you know? It's like drinking Coke out of a Pepsi cup or I don't know what I'm talking about. So this is pretty much a, kind of like a trade I did with Stevie Breach. He wanted some, uh, there was like a Andre Funko um, and like a lunchbox and a t-shirt um, that you like can only find at Walmart and uh, I bought it for him because he couldn't find it anywhere and then he, uh, he uh, what's it called oh Tony Storm that scared me a little bit Tony Storm is the uh, the main card I'm going for so we got the first first NXT card definitely gonna go in a sleeve there uh, but basically he couldn't find those things at his Walmart he made a video about it if you want to go check it out um, pretty much unboxing what I sent him and he was like hey go back to Walmart and buy me that stuff and I instead of having him you know send money or whatever I just pretty much uh, told him to buy me this so I think there's an auto coming up but we're just gonna go for it There's not an auto. I'm really bad at this, so that's fun. Um, probably team dream. If I got his auto, that'd be the most hilarious thing ever. So shout out to everyone who did their uh, favorite cards in their collection response. That was a, a fun couple of videos to watch. And uh, let's see, see these cards. Yeah, Johnny Gargano, you're scaring me there. It's because you, you look like an auto. You're not an auto. And uh, it is what it is. Let's just pay some respects to Adam Cole, who died on being the elite. And now he's alive in NXT, his ghost, the ghost of Adam Cole. Um, but basically, uh, the other day, I made a purchase that should be coming in the next couple of days to so look out for an unboxing of that. Uh, it's probably the most expensive card I've ever bought. Um, so that should be that should be interesting. It's literally probably could have been the main event of that video that I made, and I bought it right after I uploaded that video. So that's fun. Should have probably waited like a week to do that video. Is that something? I don't know. Um, we're just gonna go for it because I don't know what this looks like. Oh, number to 25, Tyler Bate, Walter, Walter. Uh, what is this? We got Pete Dunn and Roderick Strong defeat Oni Lorcan and Danny Birch. I'm assuming that's silver number to 25. That is awesome. Um, not bad. Also, if you want to go check out mine and Justin, aka RKO the Infamous, RKO the Infamous NWO, uh, we started a little podcast thing, like Quarantine Chronicles. It's on his channel, so you can go check that out. Link will be down below if I remember to put the link in there. Um, just another brown, nothing. These are that, that's weird. That looks like a. It looked like a. They're colored, you know. Uh, that one looks like a red. That one looks like a blue. But that's so cool because I don't think I have his first. I don't think I have his first card, so that's pretty sweet. I think this is the auto. Okay, Chelsea Green, number to 99. Not bad. Shout out Zack Ryder. That is pretty sweet. Don't have her autograph. Of All In fame, she is in the All In. So that's a good one to have. Nice, dude. I was worried that it was going to be someone random that I just didn't care about. But first, on card, Chelsea Green autograph. Like I said, of all in fame. That's a historic card for an historic match. So there we go. First autograph right there, Chelsea Green. Can't go wrong with that. And it's number to 99. Forgot to say it. I think it's like bronze number to 99. 
about halfway through, if I had to eyeball pretty much all, we got a lot of cards in this. Is that the last autograph? I think that's the last autograph. I don't know. We're just going to go for it because I don't know what's going on here. Eric. Okay. Don't know who that is, but look at that autograph. <laughs> so, um, yeah, so you win some and you lose some. Have no idea who that is, but I mean, he took the time to draw a little picture, if you will, on his uh, on his autograph card right there. Okay, uh, NXT called up. I'm assuming that's like, what was his name? Was he in New Japan or something? Don't know who that is. Let's see, oh wait, they don't tell you who he is because that's, I don't know. All right, well, there we go. So that's that, let's see if we get anything else. I'm gonna s probably cut out a lot of this and just hop to the end when it's just me showing off the cards again because yeah, I know some of these names. That's a lot of names. If I knew it was the autograph, probably should have kept it till the end. So pretty much now the hunt is still on for the Tony Storm uh, autograph because those those are a lot more expensive than I want to pay for because people are going nuts about her. So that's good to see that you know people care as much as I do. Um, but you know, it's an expensive card to get. Oh, there we go. We got another numbered card, number to fifty. United Kingdom champion Pete Dunne defeats Roderick Strong. Not bad. So you got two numbered cards out of this. So that's pretty sweet. Last couple packs. I've got a huge stack over there. What am I doing? I am retiring from opening cards on video because this is, this is something. This is a lot of work. Shout out to everybody who makes card videos because this is, I got two Keith Lee's in a row. This is something else, let me tell you. You got a lot of stuff that you got to worry about. Angelo Dawkins and Roderick Strong. A lot of stuff you got to like do. You got to like talk the whole time. You got to, you know, the interest. Sometimes if it's somebody that I just want to watch what they get, if it's not one of my friends, I just will skip through to find the hits. There's the base card of that one I showed earlier. Oh man. We got a YWC legend coming up here. YWC Legend. Last pack of the break. Let's see what happens. No autograph, definitely, because uh, I think Sean got a box once. Or, oh, look at this. Hit of the break. This is the very rare, I don't know if you can see, but the Lorenzo Bros and Joe, Joe, one half of Motor City Marks, in the card. I mean, I'll be honest. This is a lot better than this card <laughs> right here. I have no idea who this is. But I know who those three are right there. So that is the, uh, I'm going to put that in a, a penny sleeve and a top loader. Get them to sign it. Maybe I'll do a TTM where they can, uh, you know, send back the card or whatever. And look at that. We're ending. I don't know who Conor Reeves is. But we're ending with the Matt Riddle. First NXT card. The best card obviously being this uh, Chelsea Green. First NXT autograph. So that's awesome. Definitely the... Uh, the hit of the break minus the Lorenzo Bros and Joe card. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in a couple days with that uh, eBay unboxing that uh, is burning my wallet right now. So that's it. Thanks for watching. See you on the next one.